As widely expected, South Korea's central bank today decided to keep interest rates where they are. It's under pressure to lower them, but at the same time, there was concern about the weakness of the Korean won. Kim Hye-sung reports. The Bank of Korea on Friday kept its benchmark interest rate unchanged at 1.75 percent. This marks the fourth straight rate freeze after it raised its key rate by a quarter of a percent last November. Sluggish domestic economic data have put pressure on the central bank to cut rates and help boost the economy, but growing external uncertainties over the U.S.-China trade dispute and concerns over possible capital flight prompted the BOK to hold rates steady. The South Korean won has weakened more than 5 percent in the last three months to near 1,200 won against the greenback, the worst performer in Asia, so cutting rates too soon could knock the won even lower, creating capital flight risks. Exports, a key driver of South Korea's domestic growth, have fallen for five straight months since December on lower global demand. For the first 20 days in May, exports tumbled 12 percent on year, with chip sector shipments plunging 22 percent, set for a sixth straight month of decline. The local economy contracted 0.3 percent in the first quarter of 2019 on falling exports and investment, the slowest growth since the 2008 global financial crisis. Headline inflation remained at around 0.5 percent through April, lower than the central bank's 2 percent target and its forecast of 1.1 percent for this year. Kim Hye-sung, Arirang News.